All right, we have a new arrival today at Westport Auto Center. This is a gorgeous 1977 GMC Sierra Classic California truck, 350, ice cold air, pretty original truck, one repaint, uh, factory clockworks, key buzzer, uh, radio, gauges, etc. Just a really cool, solid truck. Again, one repaint. Um, there's a few little nicks and chips on it. Uh, let's see, we're touched up a little bit there, a little bit there. Um, believe at one time it had one of those bug guards on it. Probably looked pretty cool with another one on it. Bug deflectors, I should say. Uh, Mickey Thompson, Sportsman. Nice straight truck. Bumper's good, it does have the trailer hitch. It does have a line of bed in it, one of the plastic all-star line of beds. Just a nice truck. Little touch up there. Couple small spots there on the door. You know, it's uh truck's been driven but still shows extremely well but, uh, like I said there's a few little scratches there on the front but being picky you walk around the truck it's pretty darn nice couple small Supposedly was repainted in the uh, early 2000s. Still, still showing pretty well. Cargo light. It does have the uh, that's the wheel lug nut, uh, the protecto plate, owner's manual. Everything right in there. California truck. Let's see right there. Pretty cool. But nice truck. <laughs> I want to probably say somebody replaced the rear bumper. Uh, it's maybe not. There is a little bit of hazing on it. Maybe not, but it, it's held up pretty well. Typical scuff marks from your shoes getting in and out of the truck. Steering wheel, dash, all that's in great shape. Gonna go ahead and do the blinkers, lights, horns, all that good stuff. And take it for a test drive. There you have your parking lights. There you have your headlights. And there you have your brights. Oh, blinker. And there you got your blinker working. Horn does work. Wipers. Gonna take you around the rear. Tail lights work. Blinker works. Passenger blinker works. Both tail lights, brake lights, and then you have your reverse lights. All right, let's take the first spin. Take this bad boy for a ride. It does show dual tanks right here. I have not have not tried that. We got the radio. It's 
temperature gauge, oil pressure, voltage, and even the clocks work, which is pretty crazy. So they didn't work practically when they were uh, new. And even the uh, windshield wiper pump works on it. Pretty crazy. to the warehouse uh, we'll run in grab the thermometer and uh, show you just how cool this uh, air conditioning gets on a hot hot st. Louis summer afternoon but we'll have uh, close to 100 detailed pictures posted this video is obviously going to be on YouTube. If you want to fly in, I'm more than happy to pick you up at the airport. It's uh, St. Louis International, Lambert. It's one and the same, about a half hour from uh, our warehouses. I'm more than happy to pick you up. Check out our website at www.westportautocenter.com. Lots of other vehicles and trucks on there. Everything on this works. Great truck, California truck. Turnkey. Anybody can fly in, drive in, drive it home. Just had a gentleman come in, picked up a 72 truck, 1972 Chevy truck, and uh, drove it back to Raleigh, North Carolina with no problems whatsoever. obviously work in the dash as well speedometer speedometer is working we're going a steady 35 here blinkers do work inside we got it the factory radio wasn't working so we put a uh, updated uh, radio in it and updated speakers so Got that in the bulb. More things that weren't working on it, we got it. Just a solid, straight California truck. We'll go get our uh, digital thermometer, poke it in the vent, and show you what we got. That turn signal, that turn signal. It does have the digital radio, so and again, that was your uh, your fuel selection, uh, right hand or left hand. That is one thing I have not checked. And it's sitting still, so it's not having any uh, cold air going over the condenser, but it it's cooling down. So 
Uh, or 57, so or in the mid upper, you know, 10, 56. I had it the other day, it was at like 54, 53, so. You can tell it's still going down. And it'll cool even better once you're driving down the road with some cold air going over the condenser, so. 52 degrees, not too shabby for just sitting here in a hot park lot. Thank you for watching, www.westportautocenter. Have a great day.